everybody, Jeff. Uh, you guys haven't seen me on TV in a while. That's because we aren't on TV. We did 91 episodes. We did it on OLN. It was a hell of a run. It was great. We hit 165 countries. Everybody always asks, are there going to be new more episodes? Or are you guys making new shows? Blah, blah, blah. Yes, we are currently working on it with a number of different production companies around the world. Over the next couple of months, we're going to show some clips of actually how everything works around direct liquidation and the way a day in the life of Jeff, a day in the life with Jose, a day in the life of some of the other characters that you have met. Really, uh, it's been it's been great. So what we decided to do is uh, I'm going to do. I, I met this guy that's filming right now. What was your first name again? Ace. Ace, and Ace is here today. So we thought, why not? One camera guy, one sound guy, one guy, one guy, one guy. Follow me around for a day. So today. He's going to come to the warehouse and we're just going to see exactly what happens in the day in the life of Jeff. And hopefully uh, Ace can be out of here by 2 o'clock because usually things happen pretty quick. So this, this is a regular day here. We just bought this off of Sheldon. So for 650 bucks, we we bought a dildo store. This was a bale of C's deal. And uh, Sheldon just showed up with it the other day and uh, here we are. So George, where are you? Sandeep. Sandeep, right here. Sandeep, right, come here, look. Sandeep is one of our ladies. Come on. Sandeep, Sandeep's, Sandeep's from Sandeep. India. Yeah. Are any of these made in India or are they made in China? Those are all made in China. Is it an Indian China. dildo? Anyway, as, this is a normal day at direct liquidation. We just bought this deal off of Sheldon for 650 bucks, and that's the last bit of dildos. And what time are we at here? We're at 1140. It's too bad we didn't actually see the deal, but that's what happens. And then there's Tom. Tom, say okay. hi. Hi. Here's a deal that we have on the floor that people always look at. Name brand sunglasses, $69.99. We sell them to other guys that are selling them for $100, $125, right up to $200. Bucks. We wholesale these things out. If you take $100 at a time, $39 a piece. Uh, what the hell is my story? My story with Jeff is, believe it or not, I met him through a deal of a 53-foot uh, trailer of sex toys. Okay, go ahead, Norbert. What is it? Uh, hold on a sec. Really, really, at this point, I got nothing. I sold the showroom. I, 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 he picked up on Friday. He picked up uh, 15 cents. Who? Uh, do you know Steve Lloyd? <laughs> Steve Lloyd, yes, I know Steve Lloyd. That was my... Yeah. <laughs> Steve Lloyd knows that I'm buying from you. Call Steve Lloyd and ask him. I, I, right now I got nothing. I, uh, I will, I will, I promise you I will have a note for you, but right now I don't have anything for you. As soon as I get, I, as soon as I get a decent enough load, I'll give you a call. You know what, you gotta look after me, because uh, you have no idea what we can give you. I keep telling you that, but that's about as far as it'll go. Anyway, all right. All right. I, I, Keep you in mind now, Jeff. Okay. Don't keep me in mind? You already bought... What the fuck keep me in mind? Anyway, whatever. Uh, do what you gotta do. Right. Okay. Right. I'm trying to do this fucking deal in Toronto. And and I, and he tells me on Friday, so I said, okay, I'll call you today. And the shit's gone. Anyway. I'll talk to you later. Hey, you, hey, you wanna hear something funny? Come over here. So I'm sitting on a fucking airplane flying home from Toronto last yeah. week. And this chick comes sitting next to me. She's pretty good looking. She okay. sits down to me, right? She's not married. Be no, careful, right? She's oh, sitting okay. next to me. We start talking. <laughs> she says... Everybody goes, they recognize you, they recognize you from yeah. the show, from the show. Oh, yeah, like, yeah. I go, yeah, I got a TV show, but yeah. what's it called, I tell her. Yeah. She says, oh yeah, what do you do, what do you liquidate? I yeah. said, well, I bought 40,000 dildos. Yes. <laughs> Most girls, they go, you yeah. know what she does? She says, oh yeah. I'm like, what do you mean, oh yeah? She yeah. says, yeah, that's my dad's business. I go, wait a minute, your dad named Tony? And it was, it was her fucking dad. Small world, but is, it, small. is it that small or that? But so we start talking, <laughs> that yeah. and then I start showing her this uh, this cock, yeah, okay. the, the okay. plastic zipper cock. Yes, the one. That, Can you, uh, hey, Sandeep, let me hold your coffee, and you hold this. This is actually what's known <laughs> as a plaster plastic zipper cup. A guy's trying to sell me sixty thousand of these things, and basically how they work is you go like this, and you can oh, suck Jeff, out of one. No. So, yeah. straw. So uh, so far we've sold about five thousand. The funny thing is, is we advertised them in a local newspaper in Toronto and uh, the ad rep got in deep shit. Well, take a cock with you. Take a cock back to, take no, a, I, I need, how I many need cocks four. you want? Four? Four. You're gonna I don't even know if I want to put that in my luggage. Yeah, uh, don't worry. No, don't film this. <laughs> okay, go buy four cocks. Where are they? Can I take it off the patio furniture yeah. that I bought? How much okay. are they, dollar? Yeah, a dollar each. Can you run four penises through the system, please? So, basically, Jose, nope. now that you're here, <laughs> now that you're here, we failed, we went and we filmed an episode. Yeah. Uh, at your warehouse. 
Yeah. And ba what happened when, they, when you showed up? You thought we were going to go on to the Knowledge Network. Well, when, when you told me about this show a few years ago, I really thought that you would be around 3 o'clock in the morning after <laughs> the guy that sells vacuums or something like that. And I was just so surprised when the show started. So all of a sudden you started filming with me and people all around the world were... What happens to you when you cross the border? No, I... I <laughs> well, actually, what do, you do, what do you do now? Everybody I, keeps asking me, what do you do now? I'm, I'm not telling you, it's a secret. He said, How about I answer that for you? Your <laughs> wife cooks burritos <laughs> no. and looks after a bunch of 125 to 150 Mexican no, migrant no, workers. No, 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 what do you do then? If you want to know, really want to know, yeah. Uh, we have a wire transfer agency, we, I import Mexican food products, we service about 800 Mexican workers. Yes. And yes, I cook some meals, but it's me. Okay? What do you cook? Burritos, that's what I'm <laughs> I haven't seen you naked. You, you want to see me naked? No. No, 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 hey. no, 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 no. There's another crazy South African. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, me? Ah. What the fuck are these now? Yeah, oh, for you, the... Yeah, you know, I, I found another box. There's 19 out of them, but I'm not sure. Some of them are working, some of them aren't. I'm being honest, but this one works. But I haven't... We are stored them. Let's just found the box. So. so how many do you have? Jose, what do you think? Come over here, you fucking idiot. They go on. Do we still have those things? No, we don't. They must have sold. Fuck, they didn't sell. We had to, to fucking just, donate them. It was a fucking true. deal. Just started. So what do you want for all these fucking things? No, I just a trade. Cause it's trade for what? How about a pair of sunglasses and I'll take them all. Those are 100% name brand sunglasses. Yeah, well, there's actually a bit more maybe. Well, I don't give a shit. That's all you're getting. Okay. <laughs> all right. no, 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 I don't want anything more. Okay. I'm happy with that. Thank you. Sorry, Go on. sorry to interrupt this conversation, but I think the gentleman deserves Two pairs you of can glasses. go fuck yourself. He gets one pair. No, because, because you know what? One is for me, for my son. You piece of shit. You've never paid me for the mattress. Fuck you. <laughs> you never and paid me for the mattress. You have never paid me for you, my. How about that insurance claim that you got? That I, you got six grand and I got nothing for that rotten, disgusting furniture. What are you talking about? You're ripping off this poor gentleman. I saw. I know. I thought product is gonna sell. You pay about probably. You just told me it was shit. No, 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 no. <laughs> Never say two, that. Two pairs of sunglasses will get on. So, anyways. Thank you. He gets one pair, and just I because get, you're here, I, you get one pair. There you go. Uh, can you get him a damaged pair of sunglasses? No damaged pair. <laughs> well, Ray actually sold us a bunch of shit one time. He sold us these little these belts for jogging, but he stripped all the fluorescence out of there because uh, he because they were worth more. We got them for like about fifty cents each. We sold them all online. So now we're gonna take this and. Again, this is not even noon yet. And we've already been doing a transaction, so it's not a cruel one, but we won because we'll sell those lights for about four bucks each. He doesn't know that yet. He gets a pair of sunglasses that cost me, well, let's say, cheap. So I win. Okay. So, okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's try something. I like go. Okay, come on, sorry. Okay. Just look. You're so bad. Give me one. Yeah, no. No, I don't like those. She wants a guitar. Jake's aside. The only reason I saw it is that lady walked up with us. So. Okay, so we'll go to your place okay, we'll right now. And you can take the guitar with you. You don't have to pay for it. Okay. We go we go to this great guy's house and have a look at his stuff. What is he? Doesn't fucking matter. Do you want to come? Yes or no? No, what? Shut up. You don't treat me like that in front of other people. I'd like what? Like I normally do? <laughs> Fuck you. Huh? Okay, we will go because okay. he's a super nice guy. That's and the only reason I'm going. But no, no, no. Nothing to do with <laughs> All right, so we're going to go to your house. Uh, okay, deal. Are you leaving now? We can go in a second, yeah. I mean, it's really insulting that you drive this car and you pretend always that you have no money, you fuck off. Honestly, it's insulting. You are a real asshole. You drive a $125,000 car and you always cry like a baby how tough is the situation for you. You're like Donald Trump, something as close like that. You like Donald Trump? You like your proctologist? <laughs> Man, you've been That's eating, okay. You've been eating too many fucking burritos. How much money do you owe? I... You owe I, money to this person? No, 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 no. What did you sell them? You are so limited in your Spanish, you stupid ass. So listen, I'm going to go into this deal. You got to take a piss again? You're holding I, it. I am holding... Yeah, your, my... Your little... Yeah. What, do you, what do you call your little... The anaconda. Yeah, your, your anaconda? The anaconda, yeah. Okay. So we're going to go look at this deal. The Please. anaconda is ready to puke, okay? <laughs> so... Better start moving fast. I can't imagine what your little little pepper looks like. Um, we're gonna go into this deal. 
Please shut the fuck up. I am normal. <laughs> Excuse me. No, no problem. Uh, two Ooh, things. That's not cool. Shut up. He's got to go pee. Okay, with fish. I go pee too. <laughs> so, you know what? If you can always do this shit, you know? You don't have to film us going pee, but we're going to go pee in his pee pee. <laughs> Did you wash your hands? I normally don't. Is that a problem for you? I guess it depends. Fuck you, Bendejo. Don't let him see you take the bananas. Take them in. Yeah, is there anything else you want to eat? <laughs> Fucking idiot. You so basically get... everything in here except for... Yeah, well, not, not, obviously with the, all the bicycles. None of the bicycles. And this is my kids' hockey equipment. You don't want that. That's interesting. It's, yeah, it's still, that must be 40 years old. It's still snot. But there's, like, for argument's sake, this guy here. So you can go look online. There, there's some collectibles here. The, the comics are worth a bit of money. The Star Wars stuff. He's worth about 100 bucks, that little guy. He's the Billy Blaster. I've got the box and to try and sell it individually would literally take me forever. So it would take me a year to try and sell it bit by bit. So it's just not worth it's not worth my time to be quite honest. That's a hook. There it goes. Yeah. I'm so sure that I'm What would they use this for? Cutting branches? Oh kids, I don't know. Cut what do you mean kids? No heads. Heads? Someone, I don't know what I, I'm That's how they circumcise kids in Africa. And you I'm, are fucking warped. Uh, you wanna see that video? So I'll give you that guitar. I'll give you a thousand bucks for everything. Now I know he turns around and makes a fortune, but at the end of the day, he's entitled to because it's guys like us who collect things, and then all of a sudden, it uh, becomes more of a burden for us. So. All right, but that's the next thing. Is that my wife's coming back tomorrow night? If it's not raining, I get my son to take this. That or I could send a five ton over here just with a bunch of boxes. Yeah, and you just they can just. Take I could try. I could try to get it out. So if you can, if yeah. you can start boxing, then. All right. Yeah, we'll we'll come here and load it up. Okay, Ray. Thank no, you. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you. I'm taking that cologne for me. You're not taking fuck all. That's fucking Avon. So how do you feel? Do I do okay? I feel that uh, you're very consistent. I'm very one, consistent. One more time, you took advantage of a person that is nice. You rip him off. You destroy a collection that was worth probably thousands of dollars. And yes, you just nail him. But you know that's you. Did you not listen to what he said? His wants his garage clean. He gets a thousand bucks for whatever. No, 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 no. So it's no, not a win-win. No, obviously, obviously, mm. you don't listen to the heart of the man. I listen the heart, to the heart. No, no, no. You just listen to your fucking wallet. That's all you listen. You know, he was nice. As I said, he's a super nice person. But I can see in his eyes, you know, this asshole is ripping me off. But that's okay. But you guess, know? guess what? He got his free guitar. You know, so we handed him a free guitar. Oh, through the free <laughs> guitar. Yeah, for for his. On the end of the day. Yeah, I got it for a thousand bucks. He made one thing, and it's called needs analysis. He said three times, his wife's coming back, she's in Peru, he wants an empty place. Yeah, so he didn't get ten grand for it, he got a thousand. <clears throat> really? He gets his garage back, he gets rid of the shit. By the way, he showed this deal to me six months ago, I made him an offer and he didn't sell it. Now, he decides to get a gun. That's part of what it is. Just so you understand, you don't hold on to it like this. You let it out, you understand? Oh really, no, no, I understand that. You ripped me off a few times, so I understand, Sunshine. Feel that. <laughs> Feel that, pretty Feel good. Feel this. Oh, <laughs> fuck! Fuck, I'm gonna piss it. Oh, be... fuck! No Shut more singing, up, no fuck. more singing. Just and they won't fucking slow down, these yeah, fucking... Yeah. Oh, fuck! Pee, pee in your pants. Fuck pee you! Your pants. <laughs> pee in your pants, pee in your pants. It's now 2.25. Ace, who we got to know quite well today, showed up. Ace was basically walking in. I said, get that camera rolling. You could, uh, 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 Ace, did I tell you anything about what was gonna happen today? No, not at all. Nothing. Why I saw you walk in and grab the camera and shoot. And in the meantime, we're gonna start showing you uh, some of the other characters, some of the other guys, what, what's going on, where they are in their life. Jose was always a favorite. He's actually a favorite of mine, even though he's a fucking asshole. He's an <laughs> idiot. <laughs> I still love the guy. And uh, we'll see where it goes. We're gonna do a couple of, uh, who knows, put some shit on YouTube, Instagram, or whatever the hell that thing's called, and Facebook, which you all know. But uh, check back from us from time to time. We'll do a little uh, video on uh, Facebook, and we'll try some of this YouTube shit and see how it goes. And uh, you know what? It's not always about the buy and the sell. Today, we had a call from a, a fan uh, that uh, lost her 12-year-old uh, son in a swimming accident in Ontario. Here's a lady that's happy to talk to a celebrity or a guy on TV. Really, I'm not a fucking guy on TV. I, I'm not a celebrity. I'm just a fucking guy. Somebody calls you and tells you this. I mean, I could only imagine what it was like to lose somebody. And here, here we are. I mean, that is just what happens. 
in a normal day. You know, it's hard not to take a little bit of motion to it. So we'll see uh, what happens in the final editing the result. And uh, you know what? Check back because this is going to be the first of a number and this is our first kick at the can. See you guys and we'll see you guys all soon. Take care.